Hello everyone and welcome to the MIM series with Foreign Admits. In this series, we're going to be talking all about MIM, like the benefits, the job prospects, the curriculum, profile building. So if you want to know more about this or you're considering doing the degree, please keep on watching. Hit the notification bell to never miss a video from Foreign Admits. Kicking off the video with what is MIM? So MIM or Masters in Management is a relatively newer degree in the management field for which students consider going abroad and enrolling themselves in the top colleges and universities around the world. It is often seen as an alternative to popular MBA programs but there is really no saying if one is better than the other one. MIM lately has a high demand among recruiters, it provides great opportunities to study and work abroad, it provides great networking opportunities given the faculty and the industry exposure that you get as part of the curriculum and it is designed in a way to train the students to start their career in the management field. Let's look at some of the reasons why MIM would be a great choice if you are looking to advance your career in the management field. Number one globally recognized colleges. Several schools that offer the MIM degrees are recognized worldwide for their courses that are designed for the international student audience with courses offered in English. This allows you to pursue your post-graduation in top universities of countries like USA, UK and other developed countries. Number two, little to no work experience required. One of the greatest advantages of an MIM degree is that it allows you to advance your business knowledge immediately after bachelor's as most courses require zero to three years of work experience. Number three, get a versatile study experience. MIM is designed as a program that offers in-depth theoretical classes and a great practical experience. In addition, you can choose from a wide variety of interesting electives such as psychology of money, e-commerce, business ethics, etc. Number four, get a global experience. Many schools offer a dual degree program or exchange programs wherein the student can study at a partner college or a different campus of the same school. This helps students in gaining international exposure and makes them highly employable. Number five, quick return on investment. MIM programs are generally much shorter than an MBA, most starting at 10 months. And with the business insights offered in an MIM program, you can expect to land a job post-graduation and recoup your tuition fees much more quickly than you would in an MBA. Typically, the MBA courses abroad were designed for candidates with years of work experience and thus did not take freshers or applicants with lower work experience. This led to a demand which gave way to a new course called the Masters in Management or the MIM program. Now, let's see what the actual difference between MIM and MBA is. MBA from a top school requires around three to four years of work experience, whereas MIM programs are designed for students having less than one to three years of work experience. The two programs also differ in the average age of the applicants. MIM programs can range from somewhere between 22 to 24 years of age, whereas for MBA program, the average age is from 27 to 32 years. The MIM program lasts somewhere from 10 to 14 months long, whereas a classic MBA lasts around two years, but there are one-year options available in MBA as well. To know more about this topic, you can check out our video right here. The tuition fees for MBA is almost twice that of an MIM program. Where MIM program, the tuition fees can range from $10,000 to $20,000 per year. An MBA program can cost from $40,000 and can even go up to $100,000 per year. Talking about the tuition fees, the post-graduation salary of an MBA graduate is also double that of an MIM graduate. Where the average salary of an MIM graduate is around $50,000 a year, the average salary of an MBA graduate can be as high as $100,000 a year. MBA programs have a mix of 
all aspects of management and would give exposure broadly to all areas. MIM, on the other hand, is more focused on one business specialization, such as accounting, finance, e-commerce, etc. MBA programs are designed to impart knowledge based on real-life case studies, mutual work sharing based on the work experience of the students, and hands-on approach to ongoing problems and integrating them with the curriculum. MIM, due to the target audience with relatively less or no work experience, focus more on theoretical approach and an introductory knowledge in the subject domain. MIM graduates are taken into entry-level roles, whereas an MBA graduates are taken into mid-management or leadership roles. To know more about the difference between MIM and MBA and what exactly is the right choice for you, you can check out our video right here. Now, should you pursue your MIM in India or abroad? If you're someone who's considering to pursue the MIM degree and are confused about whether you should pursue it in India or abroad, here are some things that might help make your decision easier. Since MIM as a degree originated in Europe, the courses offered by B schools in Europe are much more comprehensive, much more diverse, provide in-depth education and top-notch quality of education. MIM courses abroad are also a gold mine of networking given the diversity of students that enroll in these courses and the global opportunities that students are provided. And in today's day and age, everybody knows how important networking is. And with that, we come to the end of the first episode of the MIM series. Meet us in our next episode where we talk about the MIM curriculum and course duration. And lastly, if you've enjoyed watching this video, Please like and share this video with your friends and comment down below what other videos would you like to see from us. Subscribe to Foreign Admits and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any updates. And that is it for today's video and I will see you guys in the next video.